little before 8 a.m. on the Pennsylvania Turnpike uh, coming across to Thaddeus Stevens Technical College Graduation Day. Christian's uh, graduation walk is today at 1. Got an early start, so hopefully I can meet him for breakfast. Um, coming across the Turnpike, uh, you can see the eyes maybe a little bit red. There's a lot of emotions flowing. Uh, threw on an audio book, which is what I normally do when I'm driving long distances. And it was uh, Brene Brown's Daring Greatly, a great book. Uh, love Brene Brown's work on guilt and shame uh, and its pervasiveness through the culture and how it, what it impacts, how it seeps in, what you can do in the, uh, the antidote, which is vulnerability and uh, presence. Uh, really, really great work, and I highly suggest you check it out if you get a chance. Uh, but in this particular case, it was the end of the book, and the last couple chapters were on parenting. Um, and it, it just brought back kind of a mental Rolodex or, uh, you know, kind of post-mortem or uh, survey of, you know, the last 20-some uh, years with my son. Uh, packing up stuff last night I found some more videotapes and some old photos so uh, I got to see actual events uh, from his youth when he was like four or five and like seeing his innocence and excitement um, ah, just a lot but did the rewind and the replay and uh, you know we can always judge harshly the mistakes we made because we always do it's what we do as parents so uh, no one has a manual no one has a color-coded key timed index on the right way of doing it but overall you know there there's some things that were definitely stood out that I'm really proud of how I handled it um, and just knowing that I've done what I can and it's not over but in a lot of ways I learned as much from you through the process as I feel I taught um, in the sensitive and the beautiful part is we did it together. Um, I think so often as parents, you know, we try and protect, we wanna give everything that we didn't have. We wanna provide a different experience, but a lot of times that doesn't recognize who our children are and what they're about. Uh, it's more of a, uh, an extension or a push of what our expectations or our lacks were. So. Uh, just really kind of witnessing and, and appreciating all that Christian is and who he is. Uh, so, I don't know, i got about an hour and a half before I get there. I uh, hope to get some breakfast and catch up. And uh, the goal or the intention for today is to, uh, to stay present and just experience it with him. Stay in that moment. So, good day. Good day. Uh, more probably on the way back, but that is how I am feeling going into all of this. Following Christian, we just moved out of the dorm. We're gonna go grab some breakfast. Christian Meter, Electrical Technology, Cum Laude. Yeah, Christian! Woo, Christian! Heading back to Turnpike, about 40 minutes from home. Uh, graduation was great. Uh, Christian was happy. Uh, it was great seeing and meeting some of his friends, the names I heard but never had a chance to meet. Uh, beautiful graduation, uh, nice ceremony, good kids. Uh, his mom and I had a great time. It was nice catching up and um, the emotions came before. Now it's just a, a big sense of pride and a little bit of accomplishment or not even accomplishment, completion. Uh, yeah, feels like there's a long contract that is coming to completion and new ones are being formed. So uh, excited to get home. Christian's ahead of me a little bit on the turnpike, so he'll probably beat me home. But uh, yeah, tomorrow starts a week long of hardcore packing and moving. And if all works out, we'll be moved out with the week to spare to leave me time to clean the house and uh, provide some options. So just wanted to follow up to the earlier video. Definitely an emotional day. Uh, certainly a, a joyous one. So thanks for uh, sharing along and until the next time.